Hi, my name is Rachel Clare, and I'm the Boulder Psychic. And this video is Aura Bubble 101. So we're going to talk about your aura, the energetic space around you. If you have not watched my video on Grounding 101 or Running Energy, please do that first. So, if you are ready to talk about your aura, let's definitely check in and make sure that we are in our bodies, uncross your feet, have your feet flat on the earth, and know that you are grounded. Intend that you are grounded and see that grounding cord extending from the first chakra at the base of your spine all the way down to the center of the earth and as wide as your hips. And see that you, your attention, your awareness is in your third eye. Validate your body. You have a body. Validate that you are a spirit. Validate that earth energy that's always running. Bring it up consciously through your feet, down your cord. Validate that cosmic energy. And then as that cosmic energy comes up the front and spouts out, notice that we have this aura, we have this energetic field. Everything is energy. We are made up of energy. Everything in life is energy. And so in our space and around us, we have this field that is our space. And we can set it. And we can clear it and clean it and move things out of it and repair anywhere that we may have tears or things in our aura that we just don't need nor do we want anymore. And you can play with how big your aura is. So in general, about an arm's length in front and behind and on the sides and above and below. But that's not a hard and fast rule. You can play with where you want it to be. See what it feels like to have it closer. See what it feels like to have it further away. Find a good distance that feels good to you and just see your aura around you. See this egg shape energy body around you. And then what I always do is I call in my healing master. I call in my angels and my guides that I work with. Archangel Michael, Archangel Uriel, calling in Ganesh, if you relate to that, Saraswati, whoever you want to call in. And that might be something that you want to play with as well. Are you familiar with the Archangels? Are you familiar with different deities and different religions? And perhaps there's an energy, an archetype, a person that you really resonate with, Mary Magdalene. Mother Mary, Lilith. It can be fun to feel these energies and play with them and bring amusement. It doesn't have to be a serious thing. It can be a, a reverent, sacred, divine, beautiful thing, but the divine is in everything. So you cannot be profane toward the sacred, you know, and it's, it's okay to play with these energies and to invite them in and to feel them and to have fun and joy with it in that practice. So call in whomever you'd like and ask for their healing. Ask to give yourself a healing. Ask your spirit to give you a healing. Imagine combing through your aura. Sometimes I even envision soapy bubbles, golden soapy bubbles cleansing out my aura. I call in totem animals that I'm working with, hawk, eagle, rattlesnake energy. My totem animals come be in my face, empower me with your medicine, empower me with the magic that will help me to embody my fullest gift to be of service on this planet, my fullest potential that will help me to serve and make a difference and give and show up fully present in my body and make a difference in this world. So play with that. There are so many lineages and traditions and, you know, here in this rich land of Colorado, we've got the wolves and the crows and the Native American lore. And then we also have this rich spirituality around Hinduism and there's the yoga and all these different lineages that we can pull in these different deities and people to bring us 
magic and mystery to play with. So invite in, set the intention, ask, and you shall receive. So the more you can be in your space and play with bringing in those energies and know that you are healed and that you can heal yourself and your space is clear and ask for those tears or anything to just be repaired, you know, Archangel Michael, be my protector. Archangel Uriel, heal this space and know that it is done. So that is Aura Bubble 101 from the Boulder Psychic, and thanks for joining with me today. Namaste, namaho, I love you. Goodbye.